I suppose I have a slightly different story than, than some. Uh, what brought me here first was that I was a student at Bloomsburg University, so I have a, a connection to this place that goes back probably longer than, than most of the faculty because I was a student here first. Um, so I was a mathematics major, um, enjoyed my time here, absolutely loved my department uh, and the people in it, and I felt like uh, they gave me more than just an education in mathematics, but also um, directed my, helped me direct my career, uh, think about long-term future and, and things like that. They recommended that I go to graduate school, um, so um, they formed me into what I am today. So. Uh, when I finished graduate school and was graduating and looking for jobs, of course, one of the things on my mind was to possibly come back here. My family's from here, uh, and so it was appealing to me to get back to this geographic region. And then, uh, in particular, uh, it, it was a great idea because I would come back and work with the people that I enjoyed so much as a student. So, um, so it was a no-brainer when there were four positions open at Bloomsburg University. I applied and uh, was lucky enough to get one of them, and uh, I feel like I've come home, uh, so this is the place I'm supposed to be. In 2005, about that time frame, we were discussing in a department meeting what new majors we could come up with that would entice people who maybe wouldn't normally pick Bloomsburg as their, as their first choice school. And uh, Dr. Hartung, Dr. Paul Hartung, who was incredibly influential in my undergraduate career, uh, he's one of the people that I think uh, really turned me on to, to, to doing mathematics. He came up with this idea of, of computer forensics and said, look, I've heard of this thing, I don't really know what it is, but we should at least look at it. And um, our chairman said, is anybody willing to take a look? I raised my hand, for better or worse, and said, sure, I'll, I'll, look, I'll investigate. And so I did a lot of Googling and a lot of uh, reading and realized that there was this thing out there that was pretty neat and nobody was doing it yet in academia. So we kind of had a leg up in, in that regard and uh, it was intriguing to me uh, right away. Just like with mathematics, I jumped in with both feet, couldn't get enough of it, read everything I could read, went to as many trainings as I could go to and literally have spent the past seven years, I think, in an almost tireless uh, quest to learn everything that I could learn. So it's, uh, I, I suppose, it's that same exact character, you know, flaw or advantage, I'm not sure which, that I had before with mathematics. I, I can't get enough of it, so um, I'm very fortunate. I got to almost have a, a midlife career crisis, career change without the career change. So I still work at the same place. I still have the security of my old job, but I teach a brand new subject, which has been uh, just exhilarating, so it's been wonderful.